This is Cairo 7 Eyewitness News, 11 at 11. Wintry weather is creating some slipping and sliding on the roads tonight as some holiday travelers make their way home. And we've learned the Washington Department of Transportation is closing some roads temporarily to deal with potential dangers. Cairo 7's Monique ming Lavin is live at Snoqualmie Pass to tell us what those problems are. Monique. Well, there is a traction tire advisory tonight, Steve. Also, the DOT tells us that they will be doing some avalanche control measures overnight, which could bring traffic to a halt on 90 temporarily. That means anyone who has already checked in here to the Summit Inn, and it is checked in pretty full tonight, that they are feeling pretty lucky. Um, we, I've seen cars and ditches and people driving around just spinning out and just not really good for little cars coming up here. No chains required tonight, but at least 15 DOT crews are working round the clock to keep the pass passable. Perfect for people like Rod Hall. The last minute, about 5 o'clock, just got in the car in Bellevue and drove up for a couple of quick runs. The summit at Snoqualmie says this is the busiest week of the year. They're hoping the snow continues falling like it did today, just heavy enough for those traveling downhill. It's good nice and powdery and so soft all the way down. But not too heavy for those traveling to the hills. We're hoping to come back tomorrow too. But tonight there is some slowing down on the road. DOT says it's executing avalanche control measures on the pass beginning at midnight with no specific time yet for reopening. The summit is expecting six more inches by the time it opens tomorrow morning. Fun but pretty cold. Hoping most of the slipping and sliding stays on the slopes. I skied like the dog the black diamond. <laughs> Is that cool? Now, if you want to see how much plowing has been going on, how much snowing, take a look at that mound back there. That looks like pure snow, but we do believe that there is a minivan under there somewhere. Now, the DOT says for anyone heading up to the pass over the next couple of days, go ahead and bring chains just to be safe. Also, there will be avalanche control measures tonight on Stevens Pass from about 2 o'clock until 5 o'clock a.m. Live in Snoqualmie Pass, Monique Minglov and Cairo 7 Eyewitness News. All right, Monique, I want to hear more about the little guy on the Black Diamond run. Thanks. Let's check in with Chief Meteorologist Andy Wapler with more on what holiday travelers are driving into. Andy? Well, certainly expert skiers there like Benjamin, they don't mind the snow, but the rest of us driving, maybe we're not so hot on it. Right now around the area, a heavy driving rain, very, very heavy here around the Everett area. Where